Okay, so I've come out here this morning and we have a little activity. Two of the petals look like they might be unfurling a little bit. The bud is not quite as tight. This is the funniest thing. I'm waiting forever for this cactus bloom to open. And on my last video I mentioned this and Lynn from Desert Plants of Avalon was nice enough to comment that with the weather being unpredictable and uh, hot and then a little bit cooler and then changing back to hot, she's also noticed that some of her buds have dropped and a lot of them have just kind of stayed stationary. So I thought that was a really um, insightful comment and um, thank you Lynn for for bringing that up, but it has been kind of uh, a little bit unpredictable. I've had a lot of darkish days because of rain. We've had so much rain this summer. So uh, I think that's what's holding up this bloom. In the meantime, while we're waiting, doesn't my mistletoe cactus look great? My little Ripsalis, Bacifera. I just love the structure. It looks like a bunch of green sticks. And there's a new sprout on the top. Just reaching for the sky. Isn't that a beauty? I got this as a teeny tiny little plant. And um, it just, it's been a really exciting plant to have and watch grow up. I have it on top of a pot here because it's gotten so tall the way it hangs. And I just love it. So there's a good update for you guys. It's in really enjoying being out this summer in the polytunnel. And another plant that loves living out in the polytunnel in the summertime is my pencil cactus. This is a euphorbia. And it is just growing like gangbusters here. Isn't that beautiful, guys? And it's the most beautiful light green. It's just a beautiful light green. Look at that, guys. It's getting very big. And I like how it grows at the end here. Kind of fans out. Looks like leaves. That is another one of my pride and joys, guys. So pretty. And I just got a, a question from Kyle asking how my Gymnocolyseum seedlings are. So I thought I would include a little update. It's not the best update. There was a little bit of a mold problem which took out many of the seedlings. And I think that's why there are so many seeds in nature, because a lot of things can take out little seedlings. But I do have four little tiny gymnocalaceums in here. I hope it'll focus. They're really, really small. One of them looks bigger than the rest. But I'm thinking that um, I haven't given these enough light to give them a really good start in life. So I'm going to put them in on a sunny windowsill and hopefully they will appreciate that. They've been under um, fluorescent light and like I said they had there was a little bit of a mold issue that knocked out some of them but I do have a couple left and um, this looks like a project that I need to do again. But I will nurture these little guys and give them a spot on a sunnier windowsill, thanks to Kyle. So Kyle, uh, hopefully they will make a turn for the better because you asked about them and um, have caused me to look in here. This is pretty self-sustaining because it's a terrarium, so I don't have to come in here and water it too much. Um, but every now and then I come in and I see that it's dry and I need to add a little bit of water. So uh, hopefully in another couple months I can give you an update and show you four little seedlings that are looking a lot bigger. And there we go. Don't they look cute there? They're going to live on that sunny little windowsill. 
and get some nice natural light. Let's go see if the long-awaited bloom has opened. Ignore the mess, guys. I do a lot of gardening based out of my polytunnel. Let's go in and see. Let's see the progress. Come on in. Oh, just a little bit more open. Look at that. Not quite ready yet. I'll have to come back. Gosh, I hope this bloom is ready by this weekend's video. It sure is taking its sweet time. Beautiful anyway, even in the opening stages. Okay, let's check this afternoon. Let's see if it's opened up anymore. I, I just don't want to miss it. Can you believe how carefully I'm watching my cactus bloom. I've just waited so long for it. <gasps> Looks like it's opening up. And here we go, guys. Ta-da! There it is. It's open. Might open up a little more, or that might be it, but I think that was worth the wait. So beautiful. Cactus flowers are just so pretty. Isn't that wonderful, guys? I hope you're enjoying my little bloom as much as I am. And it looks like here's another little one. Maybe in a couple weeks we'll, we can enjoy that one as well. So thanks so much for tuning in, guys. I hope your cacti are blooming for you as well.